Hi everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today we're going to take a look at a beautiful 1964 Chevrolet C10. This truck has 1,500 miles and a complete frame off restoration. Just a super cool truck guys. Um, Jay and I bought this truck uh, down in North Carolina. It, uh, we actually drove it to and from our hotel for about three days, had it on the expressway. Great truck. Uh, late model 350 engine, 350 trans. Uh, it's got air, disc brakes, 12 bolt rear end. It's finished in a, uh, it's a pretty, it's a turquoise and white. And it's got a, just a super cool interior. It's like a, uh, I'm going to call it a, kind of in a goldish uh, uh, bronze color on the interior with bomber leather in it. Just a cool truck, and I'm telling you, runs and drives excellent. We uh, drove it for three straight days. It's a good truck. Air works. Good, solid, straight body. It's got Riddler wheels. And I just like the color combination, man. It's a real pretty color on this truck. Hopefully, when we get out in the sun, it'll kind of get a real true look at it. Just a pretty color combination too. And you can kind of see that interior which really got a real neat look to it. I like the roof line on, the, on these, this body style, the 64-65s. It's got the uh, uh, new wood bed in it. Nice and straight down the sides. Okay, nice set of uh, Riddler wheels on it, new rubber. Pretty, pretty truck. Does have the disc brakes, front sway bar. Again, yeah, late model 350 cubic inch engine, dialed up real nice underneath the hood here. Holly four barrel, uh, polished aluminum intake, ceramic headers, power steering, um, power front disc brakes, HEI distributor. Vintage heat and air, and it does work. Aluminum radiator, it's got electric fan, it also has a shroud, 350 trans. One little, can you see one little touch up mark I saw it there on the door. Good looking truck, man. I'm 
gonna say Jay now. We probably put what 40 miles on this truck. Cruised it to dinner every night. Like I say, had it on the expressway at three different times. Yeah, you can see it's got that uh, that bomber leather in there, which is pretty cool. It's got a great look to it. Very unique. It's also a spot they touched up right there. It's got a uh, get it tilt column with a billet steering wheel, low car shifter. It's got a um, uh, yeah, Ome Omega Customs dash cluster with a billet face on there. It's got 1554 on the odometer, aftermarket, um, AM, FM radio. Dual exhaust, 12 bolt rear end. It's a good looking truck, man. Looks like he had one. They've done that on purpose, or almost. What do you figure that is? I'm not real sure either. But uh, there's like a split maybe in the wood. But very, very nice. I'll just shut that. That almost looks like they cut that line in the wood for some reason. Like I say, we cruised it on the expressway. Good truck. No problem doing 70 mile an hour in it. All new carpet in here. track of our inventory guys you can do that at southernmotors.com uh, again we've kind of been encouraging people to do this if you want to see our inventory before it even hits our site you can do that on our facebook page uh, when i'm at a show or uh, jay and i are at a show i'll actually take a picture of uh, the vehicles as i purchase them so uh, you can do that again you can always give leroy a call you can do that at 248-620-3355 
pretty truck, man. It's got a good, good look to it. to see it over here in the sun as well.